Hello guys, welcome everyone. Today we'll be talking about Paris map in War of Tanks and how to play it. Let's get started and with heavy tanks. Heavy tanks on this map from both sides pretty similar. It's gonna be this area right here are where the heavies goes in um, brawl. Uh, so from both sides Let's start with the red side, uh, heavy tanks will be found in these areas here, heavy tanks will be found under the bridge right here, heavy tanks also be found over here, and heavy tanks will be playing over here. Now there's a bit another building and especially for the heavy tanks that take a really really nice uh, uh, as like nice mobility is to take this building over here and we will come into it and say or explain why taking this specific building from this side is really good for a mobility heavy tank or even a mobility medium tank but let's focus on heavy mostly now let's go on the green side the green side is pretty same things it has its own positions it's heavy tanks will be found over here Heavy tanks will be found over here. Heavy tanks will try in and take these type of positions over here under the bridge. And also can be playing behind a specific position that it doesn't work for all heavy tanks. And it's going to be like there will be a rock over here to play. And not all tanks can be played in. Especially like tall tanks. Uh, pretty much specific heavy tanks can go in here and use it as a hold down position against any tanks under the bridge here now all this area is a heavy tanks area the only thing is gonna be is brawling in here this area pushing forward after that or the same thing from the side pushing forward to this side and we'll talk about how to push from uh, both sides or let's say specifically the green side because it's very very uh you know important i see a lot of people pushing and make mistakes and they just die for example pushing above the bridge like this so let's have a look so i got this side of paris map and i'm playing a heavy tank that has a lot of armor and a little bit some type of decent mobility from this side, I always try to take this building, no matter what, even if it would take me to take one shot or even two shots. Now, taking this type of positions is allow you to have two angles on the enemy target is right and left side. As you see, we are focusing on the right side vehicles because they have kind of, uh, you know, a bad position that get countered by this position. So much fucking fun, dude. And I 
that too. In this battle, I got the other side of Paris, and we try and go on Brawl City. Same way, we got two ways to play the top of the bridge and the bottom of the bridge. I'm playing this side is definitely you have to be playing it very careful here and try to side scrape and also be careful from anything that's sneaky at K7 from shooting you. Keep in your mind this kind of position is very just counterable just like this grill doing and he's trying to counter your position. There's another hold on position right here you can sit in and just try to play and hold on all time and also this position is the one we mentioned earlier it's the rock you can play here and just not with any tanks specifically like tall tanks but you can use it with anything that has a lot of armor and a sh little bit short it's very good position to counter anything goes under the bridge or behind where that 60 tp playing in most scenarios right here I allow you to pay attention is if you turn to push forward it's better to not push forward all the way because there will be crossfire created by me tower and the enemy projector so instead i would come in here and go up and reverse or even forward if you want to and try to make sure i do not push into or you do not push into crossfire this is something very important because i see a lot of people pushing into crossfire no matter what And like usual, you just keep pushing forward and to the enemy base and clear out any enemy targets that is left. Most of the time you're brawling, you either die in your brawling position or you retreat or you just go push forward. How about medium tanks? Medium tanks will be mainly, mainly be found in areas like... Well, there's two types of medium tanks. Let's start with the armored medium tanks. The tanks that has armor are pretty much you'll find them brawling in city as well most of the time especially mediums with armor again uh, paper tanks or paper medium tanks you will find them playing this area of the field over here uh, the open field and use specific positions that we're going to mention now now again if you are playing an armored vehicle such as like 430U E50M you can go either way you can go this side and brawl the heavies just with your side scraping all that and uh, you can also play the field now we're gonna mention the positions that would be played uh, just this, about the city ones uh, from both sides is similar you know these positions can be played with uh, you know medium tanks and the green side you know these positions can be played by medium tanks as well uh, it just similar to the heavy now what if you play like a paper medium tanks or like what you can do on this map if you are playing medium in general uh, there are a few ways to play this tank as a medium uh, and I see a lot of people make from both sides a play like this and go again like this same from the red side they go like this and go aggro like this and take this hold down right here now what this we're gonna do is playing over here or playing over here pretty much you cannot go up more than that the reason why because there are there's another uh, medium tank position that can counter these positions from both sides what i mean with this is from the red side we have a position over here and from the other side we have a position over here now these two positions here and here from here they can shoot over this to this guy here and this position will shoot whatever goes up here and try to push up more um, so these are other ways to play your medium tank and I see a lot of people make this is not a mistake is a very good play but still can get RT focused if there's be in RT and the artillery will be pretty much countering these type of positions especially over here and here now if you are playing a medium tank that has armor some some of the time you can see or mostly you can do it depends on matchmaking is going into a5 area from both sides a5 here and the other side is a5 here or a6 sorry uh, now this is another medium tank position or here to play aggressive so you will be going again like this and sorry you're gonna be going like this from a base and aggressive aggroing this a6 area and from the other side similar you're going like this and go aggro like this this area 
Now, taking these positions also can get RT focused, but taking them will make, you know, you bro whatever here will take down and uh, after that you can push forward to here or push forward towards here from both sides and, you know, have angles on these areas pretty much. Those are another medium tanks areas where you can play with all your medium tanks. The field, option one, and option two is the city if you have armor on your medium tank. Now on this side of the map, we're gonna make this little bit like uh, a risky move is to take a five in a four for you, which is not that fast enough, but we'll still try and take it just to show you and give you an idea what you expect or to see in these type of positions on Paris. So we made it to his position and we have angle on that pattern or to counter him and also we have an artillery sitting at A0 and which is pretty much going to be countering my position every time I get spotted. It's not the best type of play to do on Paris but you will see it so often and sometimes it works but I do not prefer doing it myself but just in general that's where you're going to find medium tanks be doing or playing on this map. From this side, we have the E50M, which is have a little bit of armor, and I can use it, and I can go just to brawl heavies on the heavy line on Paris, and just side scrape and do all this type of brawling. And you see people making this style of play to take that building we mentioned earlier, because it's really good to take to counter with all positions that I'm playing from this side. Now, what about the paper medium tanks that doesn't have any armor or let's say the sniper tanks in general. So we're going to be talking about the tanks or medium tanks that doesn't have any armor at all. And also we're going to be talking about tank destroyers that doesn't have any armor at all. So both are very similar on this map or most of the maps are tank destroyers doesn't have any armor and medium tanks doesn't have any armor used to share the same positions or play mostly the same positions especially initial positions so from i'm gonna mark this with the blue color and those are gonna be the positions to play with tanks that doesn't have any armor from the medium and tank destroyer so playing number one position is gonna be d3 or d2 or between and from the other side, the red side is going to be D8 over here. And from both sides, also C7 and C4 or between C and B lines, there's these positions over here. This can be played by any tank or medium tank that doesn't have armor, such as sniper. However, now there's another positions can be played as initial positions with these type of tanks. No armor again are these positions over here from that green side is the e3 position and from the other side is gonna be e7 right here there are some pushes here to play now what these positions give you from both sides you can shoot from here towards here and from here towards here as well now this side will give you a nice angle to shoot anything crossing from here and from that side the same way it's gonna shoot anything crossing towards here or towards here now it all depends on what your light tank doing because that depends on what's your light tank spotting to use these positions over here so again if light tank will be do spotting you'll be doing some you know putting some shots in the middle of the match from both angles here and here now this is Paper tanks doesn't have any armor and when I say paper tanks, I'm talking specifically about medium and tank destroyers Now there is another Positions can be used for these tanks that doesn't have any armor from the tank destroyers and medium tanks are the city Positions now. What do I mean with that? There's a tree from green side at k2 k3 you can use over here to play and use your that position just to have angle towards the city over here or the bridge mainly uh, now from the other side there's another position just similar 
we mentioned earlier properly is k7 over here you can sit behind the push here and just have shots towards the bridge or any tanks start to go over here and counter so pretty much similar situation look at this boom counter from both sides right and left two positions now number three position from the red side specifically and that thing doesn't have uh it, you know you don't see it in the, on the other side this is like a very unique position is to knock the trees down over here and use this position behind the tree right here this position can be used with medium tanks doesn't have any armor and also tank destroyers but mainly tank destroyers will be playing field and that position you prefer to play with tank that has turret the reason why because you're going to be playing here knocking the two downs first and make sure you knock it the right way not mess it up and use the trees as cover and camo and put shots on anything that gets spotted over here and gets spotted over there let's have a look on this type of few positions as you see, I got the leopard from the, this side, and I'm trying to go in and use, uh, you know, the unique positions for the tank, like leopard, you know, I do not have any armor. So knocking the trees down will allow me to have some cover and just wait for my light tank to spot anything crossing towards the city, which is heavy line mainly. And you can also use this position over here, which is the main snapping position. And just need to be careful because this position gets blind shot a lot. So try to use this building and not sit exactly in the push. Another position on the city, which is you knock these trees down over here and you just play and try to cover the bridge. This position you can find mostly as two RVs use it or any tank or medium tank that has really good camo. And sometimes you have to take it from the beginning of the match and not late. The tank destroyers that has armor, pretty much you just play them like a heavy tanks on this map. You just go in and use the same position we mentioned about heavies and just play and brawl with your tank destroyers that has armor such as a 3 Yak Panzer or you know anything that has armor you don't want to go in with this type of positions which is in city with something like a grill or 15 or anything that has no armor or you know just zero armor in general now this is the position we mentioned earlier is to knock the trees down here and right now the trees are knocked by one of the teammates so we just go in and use them This position is very good you, that you can use without being spotted is shooting anything in front of you that is spotted by your teammates. And again, tank destroyers that has armor can just push forward just like heavy tanks no matter what even if you do not have any turret. What's matter is the armor. We have the Greer 15 on this map and we're using just the normal positions for paper tanks and just sniping tanks and just do our thing. And you can also use this type of angles to count on anything that you see get spotted and making some mistakes and you just cut them off by these few angles. It doesn't mean always you need to stay in the same position the rest of the game. As you see we are moving our tank destroyer even though we don't have any armor it's just to keep our you know angles on the enemy targets that's trying to push our base. But what about light tanks? Light tanks pretty much, this is not one of the favorite light tanks map, but uh, light tanks can go in from both sides and try to spot middle is by making run like this and turning back like this and same way from the other side is making run to the middle like this and turning back like this or use it. The pushes, passive pushes over here or over here, but most of the time you need to make a fast run, especially if you are an EPR. So pretty much light tanks will make these type of runs towards the middle. And also you can go in and play tanks like on the field. Very passive position with light tanks here to spot for your tank destroyer. 
I mean, very popular t light tank position over here, right here, and right here. And if everyone is the ever option is to make run over here and here. Artillery would be found A1 from this side and A0 from the other side. Most of the time on this map as a light tank unities you're gonna just play for damage to be honest because spotting on this map is not the best for light tank beside the field. And the last thing I'll mention before I end this VOD are the tricks on this map. Pretty much the same stuff I just mentioned earlier is Remember one trick from the red side is to go in and knock the C3 down and use it as cover and put damage into these tanks. And number two from the same side is this position right here. You can use it without being spotted. And number three trick is from uh, this side is to take this three here, K2, K3 with the tank has a really good camo and use it. And number two two trick is to go in and when you're trying to push this side from the green side is i mean the heavy line go under the bridge and do not continue when you reach this ear do not continue forward like this because there will be crossfire here crossfire here crossfire here maybe so it's better to go in here go up like this let's go let's go let's call it stairs okay even if it's not stairs but let's go up here and try to go up like his and try to push in from the like this in the step like this and instead of going in and doing this into crossfire like this and this you won't be able to make it if you push like that however i hope so i didn't forget anything this is all what i got for you guys on paris i'll see you guys next one for another map video